Hello everyone and welcome to the first installment of State of the Include hosted by me, Yoho Joe, where I'll be filling you in on all of the latest and greatest SRL and botting news. In this video, all we're really going to be talking about right now is the state of the SRL 07 includes, unofficial and official ones. Basically, I'll be summarizing for all the new people what exactly SRL is, what Simba is, what includes are, and what smart is, and uh, why everything is so messy right now, but in the few weeks to come, everything will become a lot cleaner and easier to install, and uh, it'll be much simpler to use overall. So uh, to aid me with this video, I've created a nice little infographic right here, and I'll just be going over this and explaining what everything is. Um, so first we have Simba, which a lot of people like to call a bot, but if you want to read this thread here by Zytex, he explains why Simba is not a bot but a program or a compiler. We have Simba, which is our bot or the compiler, which we write all of our code into here. And then what aids scripters when writing scripts for Simba are the includes. Now the first uh, include that uh, Simba mainly uses is right here, SRL. And SRL is an include for only EOC or the Evolution of Combat version of RuneScape. Uh, what an include is, is just a library of helpful functions for scripters to use so they don't have to custom make or make the same function every time in every script. So SRL is open source and worked on by the community and it just has uh, tools and functions that are easy to use to make scripting a lot easier for scripters. So SRL works for um, all the EOC scripts and SRL works with smart version 7.2 and smart version 8.0. Uh, next, what happened right a few days after uh, RS07 came out, a user named Danny RS in, uh, created the unofficial 07 include, uh, which if you've seen any, any of my previous, previous videos, you'd see that that's the include I suggested everyone in, install and use, because at the time, that was the only include out. Uh, it was very unofficial, as in it was just made by Danny RS himself with a little bit of help from others. Uh, and it was made really in a rushed manner. Uh, not that it didn't work or anything, but it was made to so people could bot instantly right away on 07, and things were added to it added to it daily. So you could say that Simba was the first working bot for 07 because of this unofficial include here. And uh, down here in this box, basically what it says is all the first few scripts made for Simba for RuneScape 07 use this unofficial 07 include because it was the only include out at the time. And even right now, some scripts are still using the Danny RS's unofficial 07 include, but slowly in the future, they're going to start to shift away. Even right now, about half scripts still use the Danny RS uh, unofficial 07 include, but now a lot more scripters, and in the future, all scripts are going to start to be using uh, what's going to be called SRL OSR. And this is going to be SRL's official include for RuneScape 07, meaning it's made by the community, it's open source, and everyone will be working on it. I'll be making an install video later on on how to install SRL OSR, and it's a very simple and easy process. It's only about two or three steps long. So now that SRL OSR is out, uh, most people are going to start making their scripts using this because it's going to be what everyone will be using in the future. So a lot of people right now are getting errors because they only have the Danny RS include installed, uh, yet they're trying to run scripts which use SRL OSR. So I'll be making a video about that later. And last but not least, uh, I'll talk about the different smart versions. Simba comes bundled with smart version 7.2, which works with both, uh, with both versions of RuneScape. You just have to change which one it loads, which I explain in one of my tutorial videos. And uh, for some reason, Smart 8.0 is not yet bundled with Simba, but it soon will be. Uh, all Smart 8.0 is is a newer version of Smart, which is better at pairing, meaning when you're running multiple scripts, you want each script to only control one Smart window and to remember which Smart window it controlled. Smart 7.2 kind of had problems with this. When you started and stopped a script, it would accidentally grab the wrong a smart window and take control of the wrong character or whatever, which was really annoying if you're running two or more scripts. Smart 8.0 supports different rendering modes as in safe mode, DirectX, and OpenGL, 
but that doesn't really matter too much since Simba only works in safe mode. Uh, Smart 8.0 has better performance overall, and it also just contained miscellaneous bug fixes. And if you've seen my videos, you could see right now you need to manually install Smart Version 8.0. But uh, as I said in the future, Simba will be coming bundled with Smart Version 8.0, and Simba will be coming bundled with SRL OSR. Uh, as an example of what this exactly means is eventually there'll be a menu up here that says SRL OSR, and all you'll have to do to install is click it, and then click update right there and it will automatically download and extract all the files to their proper locations for you. So I'll be making one nice clean video on how to get all the latest and greatest things and this video will stay relevant for a long time. Uh, my previous ones kind of just showed how to quickly get the unofficial include and start botting right away. That's basically all I wanted to cover in this first installment of State of the Include. Please subscribe and keep an eye on your YouTube newsfeed in order to see two things that will be coming up in the near future. The first one will be an install guide for SRL OSR, which as I said will be the new official SRL include that all future scripts that run RSO7 will be using. And number two is a very big and special announcement made at SRL recently, which will be very relevant to all the uh, new people who have been having trouble with the anti-leech located in scripts, and trouble solving the anti-leech, getting anti-leech scripts running, or just straight up giving up about the anti-leech. This announcement will greatly aid and help you getting all uh, free and public scripts running without any anti-leech problems. So keep an eye out for this video, which I'll be releasing tonight regarding anti-leech, and I'll be also creating an SRL OSR video in the next few days. Happy botting, and I'll see you guys next time.